the volume a bit. Let me know how the sound is. Hi, VOD people! We're playing Pac-Man World 2. Um, am I being drowned out? Are we good? Um, did you know that today's the anniversary of the guy from Supernatural confessing gay love and then immediately getting dragged to super hell by Venom? It was a big event on Tumblr. <laughs> I had no idea. Believe it or not, that's that's not the uh, the circle I, I tend to run in on the internet, but... Um, happy anniversary, I guess? Um, can you hear this lovely cutscene? What's up, Static Socks? Um, this this steel punts an election? I'm just going to assume that you guys can hear it. <laughs> um, get on Tumblr. It's going to be the new Twitter, which is scary. Thank you, Daybreak. Um, I'll pass. Um, please enjoy this ghost lore. Okay, you can hear it? Good. With the GameCube, it's, it's always kind of uh, touch and go. Didn't Tumblr already ruin itself with all of its rules? Um, the Twitter thing is a bummer, I will say. Like, I don't know... Like, that's bad for someone like me. Like, I need some sort of platform to be able to reach people. Um, which, like, I have my Discord, but, like, you know, I have more Twitter followers than people on my Discord. Um, so... Um... Look at this ghost on ghost violence. So this is, like, the plot, um... There's a pack village, and, um, the ghosts are stealing these golden fruit, which I guess protect the village, um, from a curse. We're gonna get more lore soon, um, and we'll, uh, oop, a little bit of crunch. Um, is there, oh yeah, I think Professor Pac-Man is voiced. Maybe. Um, I was saying, uh, during the Kahoot, I prefer the first Pac-Man world, but, um, this one's been, you know... It's been a happy memory for me. I was my I think it was my first PS2 game actually. I think I played it before Kingdom Hearts. Maybe. That might be fake news. Um Yeah, well Spooky's voiced. I just think the main thing for me with one versus two is um I think the environments are more creative and, and unique. Like, I feel like Pac-Man World 2 is very much like, here is the Mario, like, formula of grass level, woods level, ice, fire, underwater. Um, I like, you know, World 1 had, uh, you know, like, ruins and space and a factory, a fun house. Like, I feel like it's definitely a downgrade in terms of the, the environment theming. But um, it controls tighter. It's, um, you know, overall... Um, probably going to be a longer game. You get more mileage out of it. Um, can I... Hmm. <laughs> can my totally legit controller work, though? Um, oh, I think I did know about that Sil Blossom, but uh, I am thankfully playing on the GameCube uh, version. And um, maybe we're not, though, because <laughs> for some reason, my controller's not working. Um... Well, now we get to watch this lore again. Come on, you. Work with me here. Sorry, folks. This is, uh, no good. Hey, Sharada Sky, thank you for the raid. Hello. Um, what is going on? This should not be rocket science. I am in the application. Hmm. Hmm. What do I gotta do here? Well, hello. Um, Final Fantasy VI, that's the Kefka one, isn't it? I hope you enjoyed. Um, while I work through these... Yeah, my controller's not working. Um, which it was when I was testing, so that is um, upsetting. Let me just uh, close the GameCube again. <laughs> this is, uh, I'll have to leave a timestamp for the, uh, the VOD people as to when we actually get going here. I apologize. Let's try this again. What's a regular patch stream without everything basically not working? Um, well, now we're frozen. Well, folks, we might just be shit out of luck. I don't know what's going on. Um, you can hear it, right? But you can't see it. And now it's super loud again. 
Um, oh, I think we're good. I think we're good. I think I have it. We have liftoff. Okay, good, good, good. Let me just get it so you can actually see it now. Um, that'd be ideal. There's so many fucking instances of my GameCube running. No, 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 no. <laughs> Please, for the love of God. Please. Um, there we go. There we go. All right, here we go. <laughs> Pac-Man World. They only lost like a million people in the in the interim. All right. Uh, let's start a new game. Thank God. Whew. Come on, GameCube. Oh yeah, I started like a just a test file, so I'll just overwrite that. <clears throat> you know, to make sure my controller worked and that the settings were okay. Um, Jesus Christ, vodka. Early day, huh? Two shots <laughs> of vodka. And now I feel like it's too loud again. Pac Man. I fucking love old man voices. He's like, damn, I don't remember asking, though. I'm old as fuck! Like, I just love doing the old man voice. Two shots? How about two more? Oh. Pac-Man! Ah! <laughs> Fighter of the Ghost Man! It's true. Um, I drank last night and then went to do chores. I tried to reward myself with a new Taylor Swift vinyl, except the target near me lied that it was in stock. I did not take you for a, uh, Swifty vodka. Um, I would have thought that'd be one of the popular things that you hate. Um, gonna need, like, 500 shots of vodka to cope. But listen, the Kahoot was purposefully difficult, so I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't, uh, give yourself too much flack for that, so it'll blossom. That was, like, the point is to be evil <laughs> so um sorry for talking over the lore you gotta go get the MacGuffins to uh save the world um oh i did not know that vodka you just strike me as somebody who would be kind of above it <laughs> above the sea swift be like uh she's actually like uh she said one bad thing once in 2009 so i hate her which i would think that most people would uh find things to hate about taylor swift you love olivia rodrigo like this is all this is crazy to me um, <laughs> I would, I would really think that Vodka would not care for either of them, but, um, she did some bad things. Like, I don't know what she did. I, I would just believe that she did, you know? Um, welcome to the village. You gotta go get the shit. Uh, we're not gonna read the exposition. It's, you know, you get the items, the, you get points. There's an arcade, um, which the arcade is actually a very neat thing about, uh, PMW2. Um, you can go play classic arcade Pac-Man games in there. Um, go check it out. <clears throat> she said something problematic in her video, but she did remove it. Right, that's that's the thing I was thinking. Like, subconsciously, I was like, the environment thing, but I couldn't think of it. Because she, like, uh, flies in her jet to get groceries or whatever. She's, like, it's, like, across the street, but she gets in her private jet. Um, she does hate the environment, has a sketchy history with white feminism, and using the LGBT, LGBT community whenever it's convenient for her. Yeah, I feel like, isn't that, like, why everyone's mad about Harry Styles or, or something? Or people like Harry Styles? Um, I'm, I do my best <laughs> to keep up with everything through osmosis, but, like, I, you know, I, I don't know. Um, I did like the one T-Swift song that I heard on the radio, the new single. Um, it sounded pretty good. Um... Harry Styles, it's like, uh, I feel like people were mad about the same thing, but then I think people like him because he's, like, playing with, with gender, um, and then, you know, how he, how he presents, but, uh, I feel like some people are saying that that's bad, and I, I, I don't know, and I've, yeah, I've also heard that I'm a notorious queer bear as well, <laughs> that's, that's been told to me, um, he gets so much credit for doing nothing, um, One Direction truthers believe he's closeted, it's a whole thing, okay, um, I'm just here to learn, you know? I, I don't have an opinion about any of this, so I'm just here to observe and apparently have fun, even though... Alright. I always loved Sue's ice cream hair, and I also always love jumping on all the uh, NPCs, because they, they react appropriately. Um, the weird thing is that Sue, I feel like I'm yelling, um, was the name of the one of the ghosts in uh, Miss Pac-Man, but now she's just like a, a pack person. Um, so, go figure. And for some reason, Miss Pac-Man is like the hardest one to unlock. 
Which, like, Miss Pac-Man is objectively better than um, base vanilla Pac-Man. Um, but I feel like it should be something a little bit more different from the usual formula that you would earn at the end. Um, um, but yeah, T-Swift, you know, she's she's hitting like a, um, like a net neutral for me, I would say. Um, like, if Kanye West had beef with her, then uh, we should probably side with Taylor Swift. Um... I remember seeing that, like, that was, like, all that anyone cared about in, like, 2009, and, uh, I felt bad for her. Um, has Tasteway topped her old country stuff yet? I, I would think so. Did people really like her old country stuff? Wasn't she kind of just generic back then? Um, we were talking about, um, I love that this is just, now we're just talking about <laughs> Taylor Swift and Harry Styles. Um, we were talking about how, uh... The flop era, the concept of the flop era. Somebody asked me about it like a month or two ago. And um, I said that uh, Taylor Swift's flop era was the uh, Look What You Made Me Do. Like, that's a bad song, right? That's no good. Um, but uh, I always thought that um, Blank Space, I always have to make sure I'm not saying blank points when I think of that song. Um, blank Space is a good one. Um, the. Uh, What's the uh, James Dean Daydream song? That one's pretty good. Um, you, look What You Made Me Do is great? I don't know about that. Um, <laughs> I, I think that's, like, obnoxious. Because it samples that uh, Too Sexy For My Shirt song, and that's all I can hear when I when I hear that. And um, that song sucks. Uh, so... There's so many better songs on Reputation. What's, which one is Reputation? Is that the Look What You Made Me Do one? You can't just use the album titles and then assume I know what we're talking about. <laughs> you Need to Calm Down is from the same album. That one also seemed pretty bad. Is that the one about not being gay in the shade or something? <laughs> shade, shade's not making anyone less gay, that line. I remember hearing that one a lot. Um, oh, wasn't that the one where she made peace with Katy Perry? Or am I thinking of something else? Wasn't Look What You Made Me Do about Katy Perry? Wasn't it like a diss war? Didn't they have a diss war? Um, Barty will always defend Look What You Made Me Do. I guess someone's gotta. Um, Look What You Made Me Do is on Lover, not Reputation. Jesus. Oh, sorry. Sorry regular Pat didn't have his Taylor Swift chronology. Uh, I was gonna say straight, but maybe that's... Maybe that is the most appropriate word he is. Someone don't got it, to be honest. <laughs> Um, I'm just like, basically now it's just Taylor Swift with Pac-Man in the background. That's, that's, I mean, that's her power, her mind. Um, I don't know what me is. I, I can't think of how that goes. Um, basically the only reason I'm listening to the radio is if, like, someone borrowed my little ox dongle. Uh, yeah, I'll say it. My ox dongle. Um, every other song is good on that album. <clears throat> God of Aka is a song on a Taylor Swift album? You don't want Taylor Swift? Wouldn't she wouldn't she be powerful to harness her energy? Wouldn't she be a good ally? Not in like the traditional like um like social sense of being an ally. I mean like to go to war with. Like to harness her raw energy and like have her release like some sort of laser beam. Um I think I would want her on my side. Like there are plenty of people that I don't think um I really would want to spend a day with or be in a room with. But, like, they would be a powerful ally. Um, like Keynote. <laughs> you know? No, that's not true. Um, one day we're gonna fly Keynote to the States. And it's gonna be fun times. We gotta get him here for, like, uh, some sort of con. We gotta get all of my, my collaborators in one space. I, I will say, with this first level, I do not know how to get everything. <laughs> um, I've only done it once, and it was probably through the use of a guide. You have to, like, really position yourself. Um... Yeah, please, uh, sh share with me the Taylor Swift Essentials. Oh, I keep trying to press um, square to rev roll, but it's uh, a different button and I can't change the mapping. Um, did I say, yeah, I gotta position myself, yeah. <laughs> I gotta, uh, I gotta get up on this yellow house. I don't know how to do that. And, uh... That's the thing with Pac-Man World 2. It's easy to beat, hard to get everything. Like, very hard. 
Um, and I don't think I will try that hard to do it. Um, like, how do I get on this purple? There we go. Okay, that, that was easy. There's an apple over here. Like, I'll get everything that I can see. Um, but I don't want to, like, look up a guide and get every little fucking pack dot on the mountain level. Um, because that's, that's too much. You gotta, like, grab onto this. Get this token. Like, I appreciate it. I'm not saying it's bad because of this. I'm just saying I never got around to learning all the ins and outs. And can I rev off of this telescope? I cannot. Okay. Oh! Um. And then I think I need to... Like, how do we get out of the orange house? I think I can just use this rock, right? Yeah. Nope. Oh, 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 come on, um, what else we taught? Te teach me more about pop culture. All I know is video games. Um, bum, 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 um, rev from the arrow? That's what I thought, but like, I don't really know what that, what that's gonna get me. There's a, a token on top of that tree, um, but, like, getting on this this big purple one with the mechanic, the yellow one seems... Like, I can't just get on it from... No, here's a token. Um, hope and Legacy. I still don't know what that is. Hi, Manly Mr. Man. Hello. We're just talking pop culture. Um, like, maybe rev from this one onto the green one? Oh, bitch! Is there anything on the green one? Is there a first-person mode? I doubt it. I don't think so. I don't think I need to... Well, how do I get on the purple one? Surely I need to get onto the green one from the yellow one. And then somehow get onto the purple one. Oh! Oh! Okay, okay. Oh, bitchard! What the fuck? Um... I don't think I can jump on green. Ugh! Pac-Man just fucking wilts at any slight inconvenience. He just turns into a little ball. Um, Return of the Living Dead. You know what? I've never watched, like, an actual zombie movie. Um, the only zombie media I've really ever consumed is, like, Walking Dead and Left 4 Dead. Um, I, uh, I just never knew where to start. Like, do you watch, like, the old Romero ones? Do I, can I roll on it from here? Nope. Um... Um, the only Olivia Rodrigo song I know... No, actually, I know two. I know the Driver's License one, and I, I think it's just called Driver's License. The Driver's License one! Playing on my Nintendo! I was talking with a regular GF about how, um, every game console that you play as a child to your grandma is a Nintendo. Um, anyway, I know that one, and I know the, the Good For You. That's, she, that's her, too, right? That's the same person? I think, uh, the Good For You one, I like that. Um, I, uh, it's like kind of pop punk, you know? I don't know what to do with the... Can I get onto the purple tree? I think I rule off of that as well. Oh, never mind. Oh, I kind of can? Wait. Wait a minute. Pac-Man, you're drunk. I definitely was standing on it. Okay. Oh, but I, he slides off. Yeah, if I just stand there and don't touch the control stick, he slides off. Oh? But he can do this sometimes? I don't know. Mm. Um, no, but that sounds like it would work so naturally, Barty. Um, maybe that's what it reminded me of. Maybe I was reminded of Paramore or like Avril Lavigne or something. Is that a fair corollary to make? Is Olivia Rodrigo the Avril Lavigne of the 2020s? Um, I'm sure that's either a terrible take or something that's super obvious, and I don't know which one. Oh! Oh! Okay, that's... That, okay. I feel like I got really lucky with that. Um, and then I think I want to rev onto... No! Was I dumb? Um, I don't remember how I got up there. I think I rev from the orange onto that under the purple. I just have to avoid the chimney. Yeah. Ooh, that is tough. Um, thank you, Barty. Um, I love a good mashup. I'm a total slut for mashups. Um. 
I ever key. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, Pac-Man World 2, I got, it was like, I still remember this to this day. I mean, when did this game come out? Um, 2002, 2003? Oh, you know, I had to have played it before KH1 because, um, my dad got this game for me. So this came out in February of 2002 in the States. So, and then KH1 would have been in November of that year for me. So yeah, this was my first PS2 game. I was so sick in the uh, February, I guess, or probably March of uh, 2002. And my dad comes home with, ready? I've said this on stream before, but a PlayStation 2, a copy of this game, Pac-Man World 2, a sequel to my favorite PS1 game, which is Pac-Man World 1, and Jimmy Neutron, Boy Genius, the movie on VHS. Um, such a great, great day. I remember it still very fondly. Regular dad, fucking crushing it. Um, remind your viewers to follow. This could be a good time to remind viewers to follow you so they can catch your next stream. Um, if you're not following, follow me. I, that's, that's never happened before. Um, OBS is telling me to remind you to follow. So, do it. Um, now, can, can I X this out? Yeah, if you're following already, then I guess, you know, you're good. Um, yo, I love the Jimmy Neutron movie. Because I had only seen it on TV, like, once prior to that, and then my dad fucking snagged it on, uh... Oh! Or was it on TV, or did I see it in the theater? I don't know. I may have seen it in the theater. Was it in the theater? I don't really know. But I know I'd only seen it once prior to, uh, getting it on VHS. Yeah, fuck OBS, don't follow, go pledge on Patreon. It wasn't a theater? Maybe I did see it in a theater. Again, I was like five during all this, um, it's like some of my earliest memories. But I was like, oh, my dad's a god. Like, he's, uh, he's an immortal superhero who can just get these things. I was just mesmerized by the idea of there being a PlayStation 2. I was like, a sequel to a console? That's nuts. Obviously, there had been follow-ups to consoles in the past, but that was the first one I knew where they just tacked a fucking two at the end. All right, can I can I just like butt bounce from here? <laughs> yeah, I totally could have done that the first time. All right, I got all the melons, and then what else do I need? There's what is that? An orange? And there's a token on the tree, which I am oblivious to how to get that. Um. Or am I going to bite the bullet and start a podcast? Do we really need another dude? A dude like me, <laughs> so to speak, doing a podcast? Like, what would I talk about? Um, I already talk about everything I want to talk about on stream, you know? Um, I don't know. I don't know if we really need that. I'm not saying never, but it's like... Uh, I'd be more interested in talking to other people. I would probably want to have a guest every episode. Um, there will always be more. It might as well be me, I guess. Yeah, I like guesting. Like, I love being on the, uh, the Spike Getty Bros podcast. Like, uh, because then I have no, like, I have no obligations or responsibilities. I just get to talk and they get to drive the, the conversation. Um, I get to complain, which I do anyway. How the fuck? We're not going to make it very far in this stream, I don't think. Um... You know, I, I would love something like that. I would love to just, like, have a sit-down with people who also make KH shit or just like, you know, consuming KH shit. Um, I don't know what we would talk about besides, you know, shooting the shit, I guess, but... You know, it's a bibbity bobbity boo in the background. Maybe just because we've been here for a long time, it's starting to get repetitive. What the fuck? How do I get that? It's got to be, like, off of the telescope or the arcade sign. Die, Professor Pac-Man! Yeah, I'm not a master at this game by any means. There's no way it's gonna be off the telescope. That's way too far. If I could even fucking grab it. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Pac-Man, fucking grab it. You grabbed it before. Oh, you fucker. Oh. That coin has always evaded me. I think it's, uh, I'm gonna fall victim to it as well. I mean, I can only imagine it would be from here. But I, like, rev up the tree somehow. Oh? 
Oh, fuck. It seemed like it was halfway to a good idea. Um, favorite movie at the moment, or just one that's been on your mind? Well, my perennial favorite's always Christmas Story, but that's kind of a lame one, I guess. Um, what's been on my mind? Ooh, well, regular GF and I just watched um, Friday the 13th Part 2, because, to be honest, the first one was, like, fucking... It was boring. Like, it was bad, and it was boring. Um, there's, like, you know, three kind of fun moments, and they're all kind of clump clumped up at the end. Um, and Jason, spoilers, isn't really even a thing in the first movie. Um, that's gotta be what you're supposed to do, but I, I'm about to give up. Um, unless it's, like, off the sign somehow? No, that doesn't make any sense. Um, yeah, Jason mid Freddy sweep. Um, no, it's, it's cool that, like, it's, you don't know who it is, and, like, it's revealed. And at the time, you know, it was, what was it, 1980? Um... It was kind of surprising, like, oh, it's the mom. It's like an older lady is the killer. Like, that's neat, but um, as a movie, it's like, not very fun or good. Um, thanks, Vodka. I guess we're gonna give up on this token. I I mean, can I just, I'll just look this one up. Hey, this bothers me, it's the first level, you know? Um, Pac-Man World 2, Pac Village Tree Token. How do you get a token on top of the tree in Pack Village 11 years ago? Go to the top of the blue house. What? And rev roll to the tree? No way. The top of the blue house. That's what I just tried. Go to the very top of the blue house. Then point to the tree and back up just enough to where you're on the side of the roof, but not rolling off. Mmm. Okay. Yeah, I guess it's more of a hub. Um, but if I come back, I have to get it all again in, in one shot, don't I? Or, I don't remember. How does that work? Like, if I don't get this token, do I have to get everything else and then get the token again to, like, make it count as 100%? We do mean this blue house, right? Get to the very... Oh, fuck! They're like, get to the very tippiest, tiny tip of the edge, but... I'm gonna roll off. What's up, Oracle? Um, come back stuff here, I'm 99% sure. I figured, but I just wanna knock it out right now. Come on, what, that's, how am I supposed to go up from there? That's crazy. Ha! Let me read this again. All right. Point to the tree, back up just enough so... Oh, back up? Oh, so I'm like treating this part... Ah, oh, fuck! <laughs> I gotta like, treat this as a ramp so I get height off of it. Because that's physics. Like this, maybe? Ha! Yes, yes! Oh, baby, I did it! And I didn't need anyone's help. It's definitely not from supercheats.com slash PlayStation 2 slash question slash Pac-Man World 2. Definitely not from there. All right, and I didn't get everything though. It didn't tell me the level is complete. I'm still missing a fucking orange. Where's that? Am I, what? Oh man. I thought I was gonna get to go to an actual level, but my, I won't let it go. Yeah, I don't think it exists. Pat's cheating again? What's new? <laughs> Sorry. Um, where's that fucking orange? Oh! Pac-Man, stop! I'm not doing that. Okay. My hubris. Hi, Carl! Carl! I'm just, like, trying to get... Is it on top of the big tree? Is that possible? What's up, Ruthie? Oh, wonderful. Um... What the fuck? What the fuck? Um, you ever want to wear Pac-Man's boots? I think I could probably rock them too. Just like fucking knee-high red boots. Yeah, I'd do it. I'm like trying to get a full... 
Oh, man. All right, now I'm gonna look up Missing Orange. Pac-Man World 2, Pac-Village, Orange. Ba -ba -ba -bum -bum. All right, definitely not looking at a YouTube video. Definitely not. I said I wasn't gonna do this, but it, you know, it's the first level. Uh. What? No, now they're in the arcade. That's useless to me. I don't know. I think I'm gonna give up. <laughs> um, it could be more than one. Well, it's, you look at my screen here. It, there's a silhouette of the orange. I don't think this level has a maze. Maybe there just is no orange? Is that possible? Am I done? Whatever. I'm done. I'm done in spirit. Oh, I hurt my butt! Yeah, there's fall damage, so... You gotta be careful. Alright, we're leaving. Fuck it. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'll save. He'll tell me if it's 100% done, right? Oh, wait, did I get it? So there just was no orange. I was just dicking around for no reason. God damn it. Alright, well, it's time for the bare basics. Kingdom Hearts 2 has screwed us again. GG. Alright, unfortunately we don't get to turn into big Pac-Man, like in Repack. But, uh, it's a little less, um, disrupting. A little less of a time sink, so. Gotta do the, uh, classic basic maze at the beginning. I, I also love Screwed. It's definitely top five favorite audio command. Especially when we're not playing Cage 2. Um, that's the best application of it. Because Cage 2 was not there for us during Hurricane Katrina. Um, and I'll never forgive it for that. Alright. Um, I don't need to read these stupid signs. I know what I'm doing. We gotta, like, speedrun this level to make up for how fucking long the pack village took. And again, I will try to get everything... But no promises. Don't fall down that crack. Oh wait, that's not that's a non-death crack. That's a fall friendly crack right there. You can fall on that crack, it's fine. What? Ba, 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 ba. what? Sorry if I missed this at the beginning. Did you grow up with this Pac-Man or how did you get to know of the game? Yeah, I was just saying that um my dad got it for me one day when I was very sick in 2002. He came home with this, um, the PS2 itself, and Jimmy Neutron on VHS. Um, so it's my first PS2 game. Um, Pac-Man World 1 was my first PS1 and just first game ever overall. Um, so I did grow up with it. I did prefer the first game, but I have fond memories of this one and playing this one with my dad. Um, boom, 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 boom. Um, a couple months ago, I went to an arcade bar with a couple of friends. Um, while I sipped on a peanut butter banana bread beer, I was locked in a death battle in three-player Pac-Man. Oh my god. Three-player Pac-Man? How does it even work? That sounds fun. Um, I always wanted to go to one of those, like, arcade bar things. There's one not too far from me. Um, I think it's in Scranton. Um, dox myself, I guess, but you already know I was in Northeast. Um, I want to say there's, like, an arcade bar in Scranton. I want to get drunk and play classics. Yeah, raise our healthcare prices, took advantage of our innate gullibility, and wasn't there for us during Hurricane Katrina. And Ashy Paws, thank you for the, uh, the sub there with Prime. Appreciate that. Um, I love shouting and swearing. That's like all my favorite things. Thank you so much, Ashy Paws. Um, all right, yeah. Don't don't stab your ass on the uh, the prickly bushes. That's bad. Pac-Man has a new move in this called the flip kick, which uh, doesn't really have that many practical applications, but it's neat. It's very very acrobatic. Don't miss that token crate. Um. But yeah, I am playing um, the GameCube uh, port of it, if you're wondering about the buttons. <clears throat> Got all the strawberries. All right, now I need the uh, the chrome ball again. Right, because I can't, I can't actually submerge myself. Oh yeah, instead of the fruit doors, there's fruit chests in this game. Extra life. 
take this. I'm going to loop back here. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I like this game. Um, it's not in my personal top 50. It's probably, like, right outside it. But, um, I was saying that, um, I just think the environments in the first game are more creative. And just overall, like, I like the sounds better, even. I think everyone prefers the, the soundtrack to this game. Um, I find it a little repetitive. I just like the, I don't know, the, the presentation and the atmosphere of the... Oh, I guess I can submerge myself. I did not need that. Um... How do I do that, though? What button? Oh, that button. There we go. Uh, what's up, spiders? <clears throat> Come on. Oh, I gotta go over here. See you, Ruthie. Have a good one. Thanks for stopping in. Take this again. Oh, I don't need both of them. Impervious to spiky bushes. Oh, it's a bear. Oh yeah, you can butt bounce the signs for whatever reason and they regrow. Is that everything? Did I get everything I needed? I think so. There's no maze in this first level either. Congratulations. Ooh, and goodbye Oracle. Thank you for stopping in. Ugh. I will save. I will. <clears throat> you everything? What? I missed a melon! Ugh! That's gonna kill me! Fuck. Alright. Whatever. We gotta roll with the punches, you know? Canyon Chaos. This is like the first level where you might die. You could, like, jump off of the buildings and pack village over and over to die from fall damage, but, uh, it's unlikely. Um, I definitely remember dying on this as a kid, so... Yo, Carly's slightly wine drunk! Let's fucking go! It's a wine Saturday, baby. Oop. Also, uh, all of the enemies, they splat into, like, green goo. And that always was kind of disturbing. Like, I don't know. Oh, these rabid dogs have, like, green goo blood. It's upsetting, though. Die! Now I kind of want to drink, man. Man. But I already did twice this week, so maybe not. Maybe not. I didn't go crazy, though. Ow! See? That fucking rabid dog bit my ass. Oh, sippy sippy patty, and then I ran into a bush. And there's a big bear. Um, I think I need to rev roll into him to kill him or something. There's something floating up there. I see you. Um. Yeah, what the fuck? I was the one to get that. Hey, the Yaddler. Yo, oh spiders, I saw your DM. I didn't get a chance to uh, to look at it yet. But, um, <laughs> thank you for subscribing to Yaddle Facts. No! <laughs> You're some of my weekly source of facts about Yaddle. Prepare for your first Yaddle Fact. Oh, man. Um, I'm playing the GameCube version. Um, the totally legit GameCube version, might I add. Um, well, give me my Yaddle Fact. Rip off the Band-Aid, I suppose. How do I get this fucking token? Um, oh, that's how you get that one. Am I almost dying? Big Yaddle stands. <laughs> Why? Why'd that make you think of me? I'm not the Yaddler. Are you sure? Are you absolutely positive? Actually, what is this TikTok that was sent to me? Why do I have two? Oh, because Vok and Barty sent me the. The videos. Oh no, it's not, it's not TikTok, it's a YouTube short. Count Dooku. Is that spoilers? I don't want to say if it's spoilers. It has to do with Count Dooku though, which I know who that is. Why even is Yaddle a thing with with uh, chat? Oh, that was um Epic Mickey we were talking about when Kiwi was like... 
Um, it is spoilers, okay. When Kiwi told me that Baby Yoda is not a younger version of Yoda, because I had no idea. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> I'm gonna get this shit again. I have no idea how to get that. What the fuck? Can I flip kick it? Can I... Oh! How embarrassing. Yeah, now I know it's Grogu, but... I had never heard Grogu that whole time. Can I, like, rev off of this? Like, this way? There's no way. Oh, fuck me! Oh... Well, I guess so, but, but, but is... Uh, Yaddle, not Yaddle, uh, Grogu is not actually a descendant of Yoda, is it? Or is it? I, I don't know. See, Arden? Hey, you take care as well, dude. It is Canyon Chaos. Same species, but, like, they're not related. Right? We don't know yet? Oh. Okay. Bam, 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 bam. I guess this is the hardest level ever. Um, <laughs> the Yaddler! <laughs> Yaddle fact for- What the fuck?! <laughs> What's going on?! Yaddle is fucking cursing the stream? Stop it! I'm not doing this! <laughs> please, 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 please stop. Okay. God damn it. I just lost like three lives. <laughs> Yeah, what is going on? What's going on? <laughs> Sorry, the Yaddler has a fact for me. Um, Yaddle's race is unnamed in Star Wars. People call it the Yoda race, and that's some sexist bullshit. Rename it to the Yaddle race. Thank you, the Yaddler, for both Yaddle Fact 43 and the 316. Is the 316 a number of significance with Yaddle? Um, yeah, that was big time curse of the Yaddle. I don't know about that. Um, that was spooky. That was like Pac-Man running off to his death several times in a row. Alright, well, how the fuck... I'm pretty sure I... I don't... Yeah, butt bounce doesn't seem to work on him. Oh, my God! No, I am bad at the game. I'm, I'm way better at, at World 1 than World 2. World 2 is harder. Um, Alright, rev you? Yeah, rev you. Rev, get revved. Oh. And I think that unlocks the maze, yeah. Alright, so let's... You know, here's what we'll do. We'll get all this shit. And then I think that acts as a save point. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> yeah, I really like this Yaddler donator. No, I'm a big fan. Yeah. All um, yours, Frosty. Hey, it's Frosty. What's going on? We're just packing. We're packing and we're slacking. I need a pee soon, actually. Unrelated. Fruit target. No. Oh, I flew too close to the sun. Oh, I s slowed down the game with my cool feature. Um. Yeah, I wanted the cherries and I paid for it. And unlike uh, World 1, if you get hit by the ghost once during the mazes, ee, you do die. In World 1, you get uh, three hits. The fruit target has appeared. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. You don't have to do that, but I want to, you know? Fruit target? Bum, 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 bum. By the way, um, we are going to play Shrek 2 on stream at some point. Um, I was thinking about it the other day, and I was realizing that many of my memories associated with that game are fun. Um, I think it'd be fun. I know Shrek is a... Uh, you know, a popular um, franchise, so. I'm sure there's other people out there who have similar memories. Like, it was low-key, not a bad license game. Oh, there is multiplayer, isn't there? I, I don't know how I would do that. Um, I'd have to either get Kiwi or regular GF um, in studio, but um, I'm not opposed to that. I don't think Kiwi would want to play uh, Shrek 2, <laughs> but... Uh. Good thing uh, Blinky is... Oh, I was going to say so dumb, but I'm so dumb. Oh. And for whatever reason... So actually, the orange ghost... I talked about this last time we played a Pac-Man game. The orange ghost is Clyde, 
But um, and for whatever reason, in Pac-Man World 2, they have the red and the orange ghost swapped. So when we fight this orange ghost coming up, it's going to call it Blinky, even though it's really Clyde. So, I don't know. I grew up learning it wrong. Um, Parsec would work if I'm emulating, say the E-word, um, and want people to play not in area, yeah. I could look into it. I would definitely need somebody to walk me through it because I am very small brain when it comes to- Oh! When it comes to basically anything, it seems. Um, including jumping on spiky bushes. I always love those little dragon guys. They're cute. Alright, I'm just getting my ass handed to me by this game. Bow, bow. I'm gonna beat this level and I'm gonna pee. Bow, bow, bow. For some reason, that one ghost has a gun, and I don't think that ever happens again. Um, so that's, the, that's the Clayton ghost. Yeah, I will definitely let you know um, when I'm ready to jump onto the Shrek 2, or any other uh, multiplayer game. I'm sure it wouldn't be that difficult. Love this shit. <clears throat> See, Paul, did you grow up with the Shrek 2... PS2 video game. I had it on PS2 and the GBA, um, and then my PS2 copy broke, and then I got it on GameCube, so I played it on three systems. Obviously on GBA, it's a different game entirely, but um, I didn't mind that one either. I thought they were both fine. I um, definitely prefer the console one, but like for a movie license game, it wasn't that bad. It probably doesn't age as well as I'm remembering. Oh! Oh! It looked very stand on Oh, no. That's no good. Alright. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. I'm all the way back here. I have one life. Please, please. Oh, my God. This has been a disaster. Alright, now what? Let's get this. Most people did not grow up with the Shrek 2 game, but it was close. Oh! Oh! Oh. The Yaddle Curse. <laughs> Thank God. Thank God that moment's preserved. I just completely lost all control. Die, gun ghost. Alright, um... We gotta do the, uh, the pack dot chain again. Let's do that. Ugh. Nine people voted. Pathetic. I know. It's just like, uh, just like America. Oh, nope, I almost ran right into the pit. I need to get an extra life, like desperately. All right. So I need to get onto that ledge, which I can surely do from this rock, right? There we go. Alright, get these. What's going on over here? Nope, not doing that. Okay. It's perilous! Please, the camera. Oh, but it's clunky. Anyone else think it's kind of clunky? A little too floaty. Oh! God. Alright, that's what I get for making fun of the comments. Alright, we can do it. We can do it! We- Oh! Is that my cage one? Oh, no! At this point, I think it's like, let's just go to the end of the level. Yeah, you're right. Kingdom you're so Hearts right. 2 has screwed us again! So true, bestie. Although I think I missed that crate last time, so at least I have that now. This is, uh, Pat plays the same parts of the video game over and over. Which I guess we're not unfamiliar with, judging from, uh, some of my Kingdom Hearts streams, but... God, this is especially demoralizing. Ooh! Jesus. Alright, please, for the love of God. Oh, you can still get hurt even though you have the power pole. I gotta remember that. As I do it again. Alright, grab this. Do the button, do the chain. 
Jesus. Oh, by the way, March Caprice 3 is uh, announced, so signups are open for that. Um, I'll probably talk about that again um, on a Tuesday, Thursday stream, but... Um, yeah, signups are already open, so that's going to be the end of March, probably... Uh, I would assume the weekend of... Uh, let's see... Yeah, it'll probably be the 24th through the 26th of March, so... March Cathrice, that's right! Um, I don't know who made the video. I'll have to uh, look. Um, I have not been super present in the organizer chat yet. Um, you know, I'm like, use me when you need me. Uh, I'm I'm uh, not that useful in terms of like preparation, but if you need me to, you know, tweet something out or, or tell people, I'll do that. I'll host a thing. I think I'm going to be hosting the Scriblio event and um, a March Caprice Kahoot at some point, so I have my uses, my utilities somewhere. All right, can we please get this? What is what? this question? Um, uh, I hate Pac-Man World 3. <laughs> I don't like it at all. Um, it's just uh, boring. Like, it's I think that's its biggest crime is that it's boring. Um, it has, like, combat in it, and that's mindless. Um, all right, can I please... There we go. That's what I should have done the first time. Oh! What the fuck, Pac-Man? And that's it! And that's it! That's the whole level! Oh, no? I thought I had no lives. Did I get another life? Fuck me, I am so sick of this! <laughs> oh, oh, and I jump onto the fucking spiky bush. It, it's not me. I swear it's not me. He just fucking rolled off. He just walked off the edge again. I, I believe me, I don't want to play Canyon Chaos for the rest of my life. But this stream is going to be three levels, I think. This is pathetic. But... Drink water. You should. Everyone should drink water. As I drink my orange aid. Yeah, Yaddle is clearly still here. Oh, man. Alright. Let's do it again. The music has started to insult me. Um, get these cherries down here. We'll do this. Kill the little dragon guys. Kill the Clayton ghost. Get this strawberry. Oh my god. The melon. I'm gonna use this rock to get up here. No. Get up there! There we go. Come on. Okay. Clunky! Alright. Please. Please, Pac-Man. Alright. Somehow took damage from that. Alright, please, 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 please. Jesus Christ. Alright. Be very careful around here. Alright. Okay. This is the one, baby. And for some reason, the game shrinks you down at the very end. You'd be like, oh, there's gonna be like a little challenge where I run around all small. And no, it just ends. And that's it. Hi, Allie. Um, had I progressed in the last 20 minutes? Now I have, but prior to that, uh, no. I don't think so. I think we spent a long time on the very first level, because I needed to get everything. I still didn't, by the way. Oh, well. I got 100%, but I did miss a token, so I guess tokens don't count towards percentage. Um, Alright, packed up on. Jesus Christ, thank God. Thank God. Alright. Um, we got these gross beetles, which I hate. And they also... Actually, they don't splat in the green goo, which is weird. That would be more acceptable than the dogs doing that. Um, very upsetting overall. Oh! I feel like I just have no control of him. He's just like... He's he's a pack on rogue. He's a loose cannon pack who doesn't play by the rules. Oh! And I have no depth perception, and that's going to be a big problem for me in the game. Um, we're doing badly at the child's game, yeah. We really are. Um, are we doing Taylor Swift polling now? That should have been a poll. 
Are you pro or anti Swifty? Ah! It's a Yaddle! A Yaddle fact 7 to the power. Oh, oh, sorry, 7 to the power of 5. Yaddle can revoke the curse. She just chooses not to. Yaddle giveth, Yaddle taketh away. God damn it. <laughs> Thank you so much, the Yaddler, for the 316. Did you know? When they took his gallbladder, they took his depth perception. Well, that's where it's stored. All of my perception of depth, that was in my little G bladder. And they took it away. I begged them to leave the depth perception part in, but they said it had to go. Um, you should Google Yaddle Alley. You'll be unpleasantly surprised. What the fuck? Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm not doing this on purpose. I don't want to torture you with the same, like, 30 second loop of music and, you know, the visual flair of Pac-Man jumping on the same crates and collecting the same fruit. I'm not... I'm not doing this as a, as a goofy meme. I just, like, straight up suck. Um, yeah, Google Yaddle. You'll love it. Alright, so I need to get this token. Um, there we go. That's what I meant to do. Ow, hurt my butt. And now we're back here, which is bad. <laughs> I, uh, didn't want to be all the way back here. Also, they, like, I like I had something in my beard, and I, like, I coughed, and it flew from my face. I don't know if that picked up... <laughs> oh, I slid down the game. <clears throat> um, I gotta trim my beard, actually. There's, like, some asymmetry going on here, and I don't like that. Um, I don't know how that happens, but... Please, Pac-Man. Get the strawberry. No, no, he, he tried to do it again. That was Yaddle. That was Yaddle right there. You see how he started walking towards the edge? That wasn't me. Oh! Um, what, what, where are you getting this from? <laughs> what did I say? I don't even remember what I said. Um, what was that thing that Roseanne said to get out of, um, she was, like, trying to excuse why she was being racist? She was like, I was taking Xanax or something. I was like, oh yeah, common side effects of Xanax being racist. Um, I don't even remember what she said or what the uh, pills were, but I prefer it was straight. When did I say that? <laughs> okay, I'm not making this thing up about Roseanne. <laughs> it's a real thing. It was like, Roseanne said something racist on Twitter, and she was like, Oh, I was taking Xanax. That made me racist. I, I swear to God, this is something that happened. It might not have been Xanax, but... Yeah, thank you, Frosty. Thank you. All yours, Frosty. Um... How am, I, how am I saying Xanax? Uh, I'm, I'm not supposed to put emphasis on the axe. Xanax. Xanax. Xan... It's, it's, I do that with Psyx, too! Until someone corrects me. It's something with the axes. Uh, Xanax. I say Xanax. <laughs> Guess I'm wrong. I've said it before in videos and no one's corrected me. Because then I call Aerith like a walking Xanax tablet. Oh my god. Well, now I know. Well, they shouldn't spell it like that. They spell it with an A. Ew, Pat. Pat, ew. Um, let me get my pack dot. See, well, Frosty also says Xanax. Maybe it's because it's spelled with a fucking A at the end. You ever think about that? Well, thanks, Barty. Thank you. Let's do a pull. Pull it right now. <laughs> I'm pissed. Oh, wait, I meant to pee, by the way. Get the orange. Grab the ledge, please, Pac-Man. All right, never mind. <sighs> I mean, why wouldn't you say Xanax? I would say Xanax if it was spelled that way, but it's not. Have I fucked myself? Can I get to that button? He's so slow in the water. All right. Let's get this button. No? I can't reach? I'm really fighting with the camera, I have to say. Alright, I guess get this and then maybe that? What did that even do? Oh. Okay. Um, a queen is never wrong. Everyone else is simply not right. See poll for pronunciation debate. Yeah, I'm voting Xanax. 
Oh, what a surprise. That's what most people are voting for. Even though it's like, you know, five people, but... <laughs> um, alright, what am I doing from up here? Hit this, hit this, get this. There we go. Oh, Pat! Oh, you fuck. We'll just spend as much time as possible on this. Wow, five people. I can't help that there's nobody here and then the people who are here aren't voting. How am I supposed to help that? That's not my fault. It can't be. There's no way it's like a, a branding issue that I have. <clears throat> oh? Oh, it's maze time. Thanks for voting with me. Ugh. If I played Epic Mickey? The good run? No. There's no such thing as a good run of Epic Mickey, I, I assure you of that. That doesn't exist. Hello? I swear to god, he's fucking with me. He can't keep getting away with it. This isn't me. Oh my god, Pac-Man, please! I feel like the controls are not as tight in these mazes as uh, World 1. Or maybe I'm just bad. It's probably that. You think Fatal Frame is really going to draw people in? I We should pull how many people know what Fatal Frame is first. You would think, uh... And listen, I'm not opposed to the idea of playing it. I just think if we're, if we're really talking honestly, more than this, I doubt it. I think more people like Pac-Man World 2 than Fatal Frame. I'm not saying I'll never play it either. I'm just saying if we're really talking about audience metrics. Um, Pac-Man World 2 is like a very uh, cherished childhood platformer for people. Um, I'm not saying it's a better game than Fatal Frame. I'm just saying in terms of recognizability. Oh god, please not Phasmophobia. My least favorite game of the past two years. <laughs> That's probably true, actually. No, wait, the Cory, the Cory, but then, then Phasmo. Actually, no, Phasmophobia had, like, a ton of potential. Um, and it's cool for, like, two minutes. Now, I don't know why I'm bullying Frosty for her spooky game taste. Um, oh no! I looked away. I looked at chat. It's gotta be the chat's fault. Um, <laughs> that was terrible. Epic Mickey Diaz, pass. I'm good. Unless anyone has like a four digit amount of money they want to donate. I'm good on Epic Mickey. Mama na 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 na. No, like, I don't know. Is Fatal Frame, um, like a household name? Like, I just don't get the impression that it is. Um, but I could be wrong. I just, like, I had never heard of it until I saw a trophy of it in Smash Bros. And had I not played Smash Bros., I still don't think I'd ever heard of it. I would have heard of it, if not for Frosty uh, pitching it to me. Um, but I'm also not, like, famously the most cultured person. Um, so... And again, it's hard It's hard to get a good gauge of uh, how many people would watch Fatal Frame when there's only, like, you know, 30-ish people here. Um, Yaddle can reverse the curse. Well, can you, can you call her up and please ask kindly? Sonic Frontiers? Honestly, me playing Sonic games on stream would probably be pretty funny. Because I, uh, I do not care for them. Um, did I get everything? Who, who knows? And, and really, who cares? Um, this game is a nightmare to 100%. So, let's just give up now. If we give up now, then we can save ourselves a lot of heartache. I have not kept up with anything about Sonic Frontiers, though. Is it... It's open world, right? Or am I making that up? Ooh! That was terrifying. Yeah, if I'm saving someone from buying a Sonic game, even if it means I have to do it myself, then I'll do it. Bam, 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 bam. Um, <clears throat> people also want me to play uh, Sly Cooper. Like, I also feel like there's more of a crossover audience with that than uh, Fatal Frame. But I do think Fatal Frame is higher up than some other things that I would like. Like, I think Fatal Frame would do better than Spore. Um, ooh, I think it would do better than... Um, what was the other thing I was thinking about? Jack and Daxter, I think, would probably do better than Fatal Frame. 
Um, there was some other game I was thinking about streaming. I think Shrek 2 would probably do better than all of them, for the record. Because it's Shrek. Um, I should just do, like, a focus group. Instead of DDD, I'd love to. I mean, even DDD doesn't draw people, you know? It's fucking boring. Um, it's fine. Like, I I'm gonna be fine regardless. I'm just, like, you know, thinking, um, business-minded. Blinky's killer frog time. Like, focusing a camera lens? Yeah. Oh, I have to check if the, uh... Oh, I thought you were hinting at my lighting issue. I ordered that lamp that you uh, sent to me, Frosty, but I don't remember if it's in store now. I'll have to see. Um, this could be a good time to remind viewers to follow you so they can catch your next stream. Oh, GBA Com. Yeah, I'm gonna do that too. Um, Spooky says you can't have that golden fruit thingy, but my big froggy tongue should get you. As long as you don't butt bounce on it. As long as you don't put your butt on its tongue. I'm just saying what he said. Um, I like the 8-bit ghosts flying around when you do the damage. Oh, that's Yaddle. That was all Yaddle. I feel like the music is shitting itself. Ow. Um, the people have spoken. Well, I will do it at some point. I promise. I just have to find the right time when I feel not insecure enough about viewership. Um, and financially stable enough to uh, not feel like uh, taking a risk is a big deal. My big froggy tongue, I'll get you with something you can't break. Let's see how you deal with the steel. I mean, even this is a financial risk, you know? It doesn't really matter. Um, think of all the people who aren't here because this isn't Fatal Frame. That is pretty much impenetrable logic, so I I can't argue with that. All right, you gotta hit the dangling thing in the back of his throat! Boom. Um, the B in Cardi B stands for Blinky, by the way. God, look at him. For the record, this is like the only unique ghost boss in the game. The rest of them are all like copy-paste of the same machine, and it's kind of lame. Um, that's another thing I always thought was kind of inferior um, when compared to one, as if the bosses in one were a lot more memorable and unique. There you go, folks. That's the golden cherries. <clears throat> hey, take it easy, spiders. Um, let the Yaddler know, if you see them, that I appreciate their, their generosity today. Alright, now I'm gonna pee. I said I was gonna do that, like, two levels ago. So, let's do that. Um, be right back. This is baby. This is baby. <laughs> And we're back. Um, 
yeah i have no no comments on my journey to the bathroom and back everything everything went well um it, my controller is not connected via bluetooth um i was taught how to do that by frosty and i totally forgot about it when i was getting ready for this so i apologize but um it shouldn't be that hard i think i can probably do it right now um let me see. Uh, no sound? Oh. Thank you. Thank you, Allie. I turned it off when I left. Um, yeah. Let me see. Uh, Bluetooth. Oh, don't I have to, like, do a button combination? Yeah. On my controller. Uh, oh, right, right, right. Oh. Hmm. Just not. Maybe I need to not be plugged in to do it. Let's try. Okay. Add device. Come on. Well, enjoy the. Uh, yeah, my GameCube settings. Yeah. <laughs> oh. All right. Well, it's not working. It's it's not able to discover it for some reason. Um, although it is blinking. Um, might have to forget it. Yeah. Well, since it's connected right now, actually. Oh, remove, remove original device. Okay. Let me remove that. Remove you. Yes. Let's try this again. Sorry, folks. The stream is, uh... This has been a mess, technical difficulty-wise. How about this? Let's try this. All done. Hey, it doesn't work at all! <laughs> uh, it was when I tested it out, but maybe it's because I'm already... Whatever, it's fine. I, uh, I, I'm fine being plugged in for today. I should have just uh, done that from the beginning, um, but I forgot. My bad, Frosty. I probably would have to like restart my GameCube. Um, I love this level, though. I love Bedoying Woods. Um, this was always my favorite as a kid. Yeah, I'd probably have to restart it. I will try to remember for next time. Assuming we continue back by World 2 next time we stream, which won't be on Saturday, so this would be like, you know, two weeks plus from now. Um, but, you know, we'll see. Oh! God, that is... They really ask you to put your life on the line for that one. Yeah, I think the woods portion of the uh, of the game is my favorite. Um, again, it's fairly generic. Like, it's just trees and woods, but it has the fun bedoying mechanics. Which are satisfying. Oh! I'm trying to go speedy now because we've lost so much time on the early game. The boing mechanics, yeah. Are there bedoings, right? Yeah. No, the actual things are called bedoings. The noise that you make is boing, though. Get a little cutscene. This isn't Bambi 2. God, God, please not Bambi 2. Or Fox and the Hound 2 or any other movies in boring fucking rural America. And I can say that because I live there. I keep hurting my ass by falling too hard. Gotta do some backtracky. There we go. And that'll take us. Oh my god! I just have like no control. What's up, buffoon? Yeah, rule during the heavy lifting. Ugh. <clears throat> All right, let's rev, baby. Kill that beetle minding his business. Get an apple. Never mind, that's a token. Where's the apple? I don't have one yet, do I? I do not. Oh, there he is. God damn. Pac-Man is just so fucking slippery. It's a horned Hercules, like from uh, Animal Crossing. I think that's what they're called, right? Oh, it's maze time. Prepare to be amazed.
Let's try not to fuck this up royally. I'm focusing. Oh, God! That's what you get. That's what you get for focusing and saying, let's not fuck it up. You run right into him like an idiot. I want the fruit target. It's my greed. That's that's the problem with the mazes. It's like, I, I don't go for the, the power pellets. Shout out to regular dad. No. Oh, my God. They're so dumb. They're so stupid. Wow. Because I want to maximize my score for some reason, which it doesn't matter. I want to try to get them all in a clump. Like, right now. And even this will fail. I won't even get all four. Maybe. 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 Ooh, just fucking barely. That's what it's all about. The thrill of the kill. Like, I don't need to be doing this. I don't think there's a benefit to having a high score on the maze. But I just... I just wanna. Fuck it up, Pat! <laughs> Thanks, Waka. Gotta fake her out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh-oh, where's Clyde? Or Blinky, whatever his fucking name is. Okay. Oh, there's fucking one lone dot up there that I gotta go get. Oh, there's a bunch over there. Alright, stay away from me. What is this question? What? One moment. Please don't go. Okay, good. You're a stupid idiot. You're a dumb idiot. Nice. Alright. Alright, I'll just finish it. As much as I wanted to chase them down for revenge. I was just talking about how I saw um, Friday the 13th Part 2, um, and it was definitely better than the first one. Um, not by much, though. I mean, the first one had, um, you know, funny moments at the end. It was very campy and overall, like, not that good and kind of boring. Um, but the second one, I think, had more memorable characters, even though they're all pretty much just, you know... Um, one name losers who are born to die. Um, I want to see part three now. I want to see because fucking Jason still isn't even wearing his hockey mask. Um, supposed to get good ish, yeah. Um, yeah, I think I need to, you know, bravely go forward in the series because I'm not that impressed by Friday the 13th yet. Like, it's fine. Bum, 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 bum. See you, Bearfax. Thank you for the Kahoot again today. I know I gave you a hard time about <laughs> one of the questions, but it's all of. Oh, oh! Stop joking around, your majesty. Hey, it's joke time. Um, Brave little toaster. Um, they fucked you up? <laughs> How did it fuck you up, buffoon? Where do uh, Pinky, Blinky, Inky, and Clyde go on vacation? Um, uh, where do they go on vacation? What's a popular spot? Spooky beach vacation. Malibu! Malibu, right? Malibu? Come on. Yes. Oh, yes. The satisfaction of getting the joke. Oh. Thank you, Ali. Good stuff. It's a ghostal resort. Oh, yeah, I didn't even read the, the parenthetical. Yeah. Ghostal coastal. Bow, bow, bow. I was like, it's gotta be some fucking thing with boo in it. <laughs> like, oh, my butt! The Ghostal Resort. <laughs> no, yeah, you're good. No worries, Fairfax. <laughs> I was just getting ticky tack over the uh, final mix, but everything else was, you know, is what, as was advertised on the tin. It's hyper obscure, difficult. Try level one. Uh, this part, um, I've lost many lives to. Oh no! 
Alright, thankfully, landing on the Bedoying doesn't hurt your butt. Jesus Christ, they just make it as- Oh! Oh, no! God, that was Yaddle again. I could just- You know what? I should just do this. That's what they want you to do. And then jump to collect them. Instead of fucking doing the flip kick. Ah! GameCube, please. Oh! Alright. All apples. Let's get the orange. The strawberry. What else? Cherry. Okay. We got another little maze down here. Oh! <laughs> uh, the Kahoot? Uh, weren't you- you didn't play in it, Buffoon? Or am I thinking of last time? I guess, yeah, you know, you played in the last one. You were in the Riku one, right? Um, it was tough. It was, um, as advertised, very difficult. And I have to do all that again! Great! At least they do give you, uh, an extra life here. Oh my god, I suck. Um, I got... Fourth? Or fifth? I think I got fifth. Yeah, I got fifth of that. Which is surprising, because I really struggled with a lot of them. Um, I think I got lucky on a, a good handful. Use some process of elimination. I fucking crushed the hurdle, though! That's all that matters! Alright, sorry for the repeat content. I've fallen into that trend, you know? Doing the same old, same old. Oh no! It was really hard. <laughs> I just got lucky. Like, th those questions were fucking. They were brain busters. Content! Uh... Pac Man World 2 is trying my patience. I feel like the checkpoints are just, uh. Cruelly unforgiving. I think World 1 was a lot more willy nilly with them. Maybe I should do the hard red target part first. So I'm not wasting time. Oh god. Alright. Please, just like. It's, it's very simple. It is a baby game, it's for little babies. Alright. Come on. Don't fuck with me. Simple as that, baby. Alright. I need to not biff the uh, landing on the netting part. That's what fucked me the first time. Um, there was a Danny Phantom? You would think there would be, like, a ton, right? Like, it's so video gameable. Um... Buffoon says, based off the Ultimate Enemy special, I only ever uh, had Nicktoons Unite, where you could play as Danny Phantom, but it wasn't like a, his own dedicated game. Um, yeah, right. It was Spongebob, Jimmy, Timmy- WHAT THE FUCK?! Oh my god, I swear I'm not doing this. That's why I need to get a Bluetooth. So it's not as, um, independent, you know? Um... I wish those games were good. I I tried playing through Nicktoons Unite several times, and I was like, "Wow, this sucks." Um, I never made it past like the second or third world. Because it was hard, I was just like, "Wow, I'm fucking bored." All right, there's a fucking checkpoint finally. Die, idiots! Oh my god, I'm a god gamer. Enjoy the chirping noise of the power pellet. At least two more times. You love it. Oh, it's so good. Isn't it music to your ears? Oh, wait, another time. Another. Let's keep it going as long as possible. God, how much do you love that noise? Bye, Barty! Take it easy. Alright, we are done with Bedoying Woods. Whew! Oh, there's a DS uh, Nicktoons uh, crossover game? Ugh! I had no idea.
but it had XJ9, Zim, El Tigre. I feel like the Wii one had some um, more obscure ones too. Like I feel like there was like Rocco representation in the in the Wii one. Did I 100% that? I did. Wow. I missed a token though. Fuck. Wait, bonus token. What does that mean? I don't know. Um. Treewood Forest, baby. Bum bum. Ba -ba -bum, -bum. <clears throat> um, I feel like I definitely do want to drink. <laughs> Maybe I'll run and get some, uh, get some mics, you know? I don't really feel like rum. Um, I want, like, a nice, flavorful, fruity drink. Oh, second bonus token from the time trial. Okay. Uh-oh, Allie the Headache Girl. Come on, join the dark side, Allie. Be a, be a tummy ache girl. That's where all the cool kids are. Oh! Fuck. Yeah, Pac-Man's gonna take a lot of razor blades to the ass in this level, I'm sorry to say. Yeah! Yeah, join us. <laughs> join the Tummy Ache Girl Coalition. Bow, bow, bow. Bow, bow, bow. All right. Hey, it's good to be Tummy Ache Girl. Pull time. Yeah, definitely Tummy Ache. Um, it's not even close for me. Although, like, I am, you know, dramatically less of a Tummy Ache Girl now that I- WHAT THE FUCK?! This is like a challenge run, I guess. Is this from the beginning? Alright, no. Jesus Christ. Um, now the G-Bladder's gone, which the G-Bladder, you know, was not part of my stomach, but I lump that in. It's really like abdominal pain, girl. It's probably better. Um, yeah, Frosty is uh, famously a headache, girl. I just feel like, uh, my GameCube's having trouble running this, actually. I'm getting, like, stuttering and obviously the, uh, independent Pac-Man moments. I guess I'm not leveling up, that's true. Um, God, like, I don't know. Is the audio choppy for you guys? Like, is it kind of cutting in and out a bit? I'm not sure if that's something that reaches you. But it's uh, definitely reaching me. It's not, like, constant, but it's... It's all right. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, what's up, Daybreak? Yeah, we're flying. We're flying pack. Just getting my ass fucking shredded by razor blades. Another Saturday night. Alright, there we go. Oh, these ones spit. These go spit. And they're probably offensive stereotypes. But I'll eat it so it goes away. If you could just, like, be above ground? Fucker. Bup, bup, bup. They had, like, similar ghosts in Pac-Man World 1, and I think they changed them. Um, oh. Usually when the music cuts a bit, I'm prepared for Pac-Man to go independent. Um, that's like the cue. Oh! Oh! It never ends. Oh, fuck me. I think my goal for the stream is to get through the, uh, the woods part. If we do pick it back up, it'll be at the, uh, the snowy part. Because I, uh... I'm not sure if we're doing it next, next Saturday. We'll have to see. This might end up in the bin of one-offs, <laughs> but... Um... Oh yeah, no, that's, it's a very, uh, it's a solid, you know, PS2 GameCube era platformer. Um, I'm just not good at it. Um, I have a couple of nitpicks about it, presentation-wise, but, you know, as, as far as the controls go and, you know, the, uh, the amount of content you get, it's it's pretty good. I feel like I'm missing... Uh, which way do I want to go? That looks like progress. That also looks like progress. But that looks like less progress? E. 
I'm complaining. That's what I do best. Oh, fuck. Just get swiped by the bear, and now... We're here. Oh, that's not too far back, thankfully. Oh, watch out. Don't get your ass shredded. Okay. Oh, fuck. He's just so fucking slippery. That's my main problem. I was saying this to regular GF the other day. Like, I need games to fucking pick a color or an object to mark what is progress, you know? Like, I need to know... If going this way is going to advance the story... Can I make this? Is this makeable? <gasps> okay, god. Oh! Well, fuck me. What even happened just now? I'm going to kill myself. I'm just going to jump off. Um, like, that's the worst part of a game. Because you're, like, trying to metagame the game, right? You're trying to be, like... Okay, if I, I have to think, like, the designer. You never want to, like, make your player think... Like, they're the designer of the game. Like, you, you want to know... You want them to naturally get the... Uh, like, you want to encourage them to look around and explore. But you don't want it to be like, here's two paths. Good luck guessing which one leads to the end of the level. And which one leads to um, optional content. I think we were talking about that because of Kirby. Which, for the most part, I think is pretty good at making it clear what uh, progress is, but there were like a couple of moments where I was like, well, I don't know. Um, so. It should just be a universal thing. Like, it should be taught, and I'm sure it is to a degree, but just some games don't do it that well. Like, which, what's a cue, or what's a tell? Like, usually it's like lighting, like you can follow lights, and that'll lead you to progress, but um, I just don't think it's universal enough. <clears throat> Another maze. Here we go. See how I can biff this one. Fruit target! Oh! Uh! God. Fruit target! I gotta get it. You can't not. God, I was dancing with the devil there. Ooh! Okay, he just ran away. Uh. <laughs> Yeesh. Um, I know God of War gives you a compass a little ways through that always points to progress, but I had no fucking clue which way was progress. It was really annoying. See, I was like, oh, that sounds good, but then I guess they biffed it. Oh, I thought he was... Orange always goes the opposite way, except for that time. Orange, like, runs away from you, so I thought I was in the clear. I ran right into him. He's the dumbest of the ghosts. Um... There are three Pac-Man worlds. Um, I only think the first two were worth anyone's while. Um, and I don't think there's any word on if they're going to get remade. I think it's probably less likely as it goes. Like, I think it, there's a decent chance for two, but I would think almost no chance for three. Because just nobody really liked it that much. Um, I mean, it has its fans out there, I'm sure, but I, I think...